Greetings to all of you, and I pray that you had a wonderful and, and beautiful evening. And I hope that you took the time to look at the scripture of St. Luke, as I asked you before, to do with your moms and dads. I hope it was rewarding, and you all had a chance to hear again through the scripture, St. Saint, Saint Luke, telling us about Jesus' youth. And also, afterwards, there was his journey and his ministry and through baptism and then ministry in, in, in with his disciples and apostles. Today, I wanted us to get ready for Easter. And that's why I brought this icon of the resurrection of Lazarus. Jesus goes and resurrects Lazarus. And this is the greatest of all things. Because no one up to that time has ever done anything like that. And no one has done it since then. That's why Jesus is the one who shares with each and every one of us that we will inherit eternal life if we believe in him. There's only one thing that he asks of us, to have faith in him and to believe in him. And that's where the great message of the church is. And the church, our church, continues to celebrate this wonderful message of Jesus resurrecting Lazarus as he will resurrect each and every one of us from this world into the heavenly world. And that's why it's so important for us as human beings to understand that we shouldn't have any fear whatsoever about our life here on earth because our life is not ending here. It continues into eternity. And that's why the church celebrates this wonderful week of Holy Week for us. And that's why we listed it as Holy Week because it's such a holy message that we see our Lord Jesus Christ going into Jerusalem, and that'll be on Palm Sunday, receiving all these cheers and admiration from people. And then all of a sudden, everybody twists and goes the other way and forces Jesus to be crucified for us upon the cross. He's crucified on the cross, he sheds his blood, and then he's buried. And then, of course, Jesus himself then is resurrected from the tomb by his heavenly Father. So my beloved brothers and little brothers and sisters, I say to you, rejoice and have no fear because Jesus is saying to each and every one of us that we will inherit eternal life if we believe in him. Thank you and I'll see you tomorrow.